welcome to its traffic in this video i am going to explain the question number seven of chapter six the question is write a strategy strategy to find the summation of all the even numbers stored in an array write a c program for the same if the array elements are one two three four five six seven seven eight the output of the program will be 20 means first we have to write the steps what steps we are going to follow to solve this problem and after that also we have to write the program and we have to add only the even numbers for example from these numbers we have to add 2 plus 4 plus 6 plus 8 2 plus 4 it is 6 6 plus 6 12 6 plus 12 plus 8 it is 20 so the answer should be 20 so for that first uh, our step should be we'll declare the variables first we'll declare an array with size of with size of uh, 10 or whatever numbers are there we'll count the numbers 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 9 numbers are there so we can keep the array size is 9 also after that oh uh, here size is not given <laughs> given so we can keep 10 also after that we'll take input to the array even we can do we can take uh, the number of elements from user also after that we'll take input in number two step to the array after that we'll write another for loop inside the for loop we'll divide the array element by two and check the remainder if the remainder is zero then we'll add this value and store the result in inside sum and at last step outside the loop will display the result now let's do the program this program i'm going to do in mobile so first uh, i'll open coding in c and we'll reset the program after resetting the program we'll cut the printf hello world line here i'm going to display the uh, declare the variable int num and within square bracket will give size as 10 and one more variable this is for counter it is i now we'll take input for the array so we'll write 4 and within bracket we'll write i equal 0 then semicolon i less than 10 then again semicolon i plus plus after that within curly braces we are going to first write a printf statement there we'll write printf inside the printf statement we'll write enter element percentage d then slash n and in percent d will display the value of i plus 1 now we'll go to the next line In next line we will write scanf statement inside scanf we will write percent d within double quotation percent d and we'll store it in n percent uh, m percent num within square bracket i so we read the input to the array now we have to compare we have to calculate the sum for that we'll write another for loop for here we'll write again this i equal 0 then semicolon i less than 10 semicolon 
i plus plus and inside this for loop we will write if statement will divide the value of uh, elements of the array by 2 so if num within square bracket i then we'll write module 2 then double equal 0 if it is then we'll write printf statement sorry we'll not write printf statement we'll add the value to sum we'll need one more variable so we'll keep one more variable here sum and we'll give the value as 0 and here we'll write sum equal sum plus num i so this statement will calculate the even numbers now we will come out from the for loop and we will write one printf statement so printf here we'll write sum is percent d and the d value will be sum now let's run the program asking me to enter element element 1 suppose 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 4 5 6 so if we add all these even numbers we'll get the answer is 30 means if we plus 2 plus 4 2 plus 4 it is 6 6 plus 6 12 12 plus 8 30 30 plus sorry from here 2 plus 4 it is 6 6 plus 6 it is 12 12 plus 8 it is uh, 20 20 plus 4 it is 24 again plus 6 it is 30 so the sum is 30 now if we need n number of elements inside the array then what we will do for that just we have to write two more extra line so first we will write printf statement inside the printf statement we will ask a question enter the number of element enter the number of elements we'll write here and we'll come to next line here we'll scan or oh, we need a variable also the variable name will keep as n int n then scan f statement inside scanf statement we'll read the n so percent d and we will store it in m person n now here instead of 10 we will give n means now we don't know the size of array whatever the user will enter that one that one will be size so wherever we have written 10 we will replace it with n here also we will replace it with n now let's run the program so number of element asking me first suppose it is 5 now enter element 1 7 6 4 9 the last element 3 sum is 10 means our even number here 6 plus 4 it is 10 so the our program is correct so this is the program you can see from here you can note down in copy or you can practice it yourself i hope you have understood the program and now next uh, number question number 8 both uh, 7 and 8 are same just here little bit different the first program was even numbers stored inside there and question number 8 the even position numbers 
only this much uh, changes is required so what we'll do we'll come inside the logic here it's given num i equal modulus 2 double equal 0 now we need even places and always remember array start from 0 array position so first position will be 0 second position will be 1 so means the odd number will be even positions in an array so we will write if i <coughs> if inside bracket we will write i plus 0 if i plus 0 modulus 2 double equal 0 then sum equal sum just this much changes we have to do now let's run the program this will be answer of question number 8 so asking me to enter the elements suppose 6 elements then numbers are 2 3 4 5 6 7 these are answer sum is 12 now let's calculate the event places the first event places is 3 then 5 3 plus 5 8 Our first uh, second position is 3, then fourth position 5, 3 plus 5, 8, and sixth position 7, 8 plus 7, 15. So, what came? Uh, <clears throat> 2 plus 4, 6. Some things. Oh, we have to give uh, not. They are asking me even places. So we have to give not equal 0 means if uh, position 0 then it will be definitely number 1 position so we will keep it here not equal 0. Now run the program number of elements 6 value 2 3 4 5 6 7 and now you see the sum is 15 so we are adding here the first uh, even position numbers element 2 that is uh, 3 element 4 that is 5 3 plus 5 8 and element 6 that is 7 8 plus 7 15 so the answer is 15 so this will be the answer of question number 8 in next video i am going to explain you the question number 9 and 10 uh, thank you for watching i have already shared the answers in telegram so whoever not subscribed to telegram you can subscribe and download the pdf thank you for watching see you in a new video till then take care and bye